Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'll be doing the unboxing and review for the one of the mid-range smartphone that nilabas ng Oppo under ng Reno series. So without any further talking, let's go ahead and unbox the Oppo Reno 3. Welcome back to my channel guys. So before anything else at the unbox natin ang Oppo Reno 3, invite ko lang ulit kayo guys sa aking ongoing giveaway sa aking channel which is the Waxitech Road to 10k subscriber. I'll be putting the link on the description box and also sa comment section. So if you have time and for sure marami naman time time right now because of the ongoing um, ECQ sa ating bansa. So, sali kayo para at least magkaroon kayo ng chance to win the Yumidi G A3X na smartphone and also the Huawei Freelace. And again guys, kung wala naman talaga tayo importante yung gagawin sa labas ng bahay, as much as possible, let's just stay at home and enjoy natin yung time with our families and friends. And also, kung wala naman talaga kayo magawa, just watch my unboxing video sa aking channel and also sa unboxing video ko for the Oppo Reno 3. And the variant that we have right now, guys, is the 8GB of RAM and 128GB of internal storage. And the color that we have is the Aurora Blue. So right away, guys, we're going to open the small box and check what we have in our small box. So inside the small box guys, we have the SIM pin ejector. I think this is the user guide manual and the warranty card and we also have the free jelly case. So let's set this aside and check natin kung ano pa meron sa loob ng ating Oppo Reno 3. So we also have the USB Type-C cable, headset, and the wall charger. Let's set aside natin yung box and the accessories and let's start removing the plastic and also set up ang ating Oppo Reno. So ito na ang ating Oppo Reno 3 guys and as you can see we have a 48 megapixel with 20 times zoom, 44 megapixel ultra night selfie camera and we also have an ultra clear 108 megapixel image, 64 point inch AMOLED screen and also a book flash charge 3.0 so we remove the nothing plastic guys and let's start setting up our oppo reno 3. although this is not the first time na nakita tayo ng aurora blue na color sa isang smartphone but sobrang gandang ganda pa rin talaga ako sa kanya guys the only complaint that i have for this type of color at yung ganitong finish is sobrang fingerprint magnet talaga siya guys and as you can see Sobrang dali niyang kapitan ng fingerprint. And before we set up our Oppo Reno 3, itorok ko lang kayo guys kung ano pang meron sa labas ng ating phone. So sa right part ng ating phone guys, we have the power button na may color green accent. And sa left part naman guys, we have the SIM tray, the volume rocker, and on the upper part of the phone, we have the secondary microphone. And sa lower part naman guys, we have the 3.5mm headphone jack, microphone, USB Type-C port, and the speaker grill. So let's go ahead, start setting up our Oppo Reno 3. Okay guys, we're done setting up the Oppo Reno 3 and let's check naman kung responsive ba at mabilis ang ating fingerprint scanner para sa ating phone. So 
So far guys, when it comes to the responsiveness para sa ating fingerprint scanner, okay na okay siya for me guys. Sobrang mabilis siya and responsive naman siya and very accurate naman siya. So overall, I'm really happy right now sa design and also sa display. Sobrang ganda ng display para sa ating Oppo Reno3 guys. As you can see, sobrang vibrant ng colors and yung mga icons niya guys, sobrang dino and also the text. Very crisp ang mga color guys, very vibrant. Sobrang okay na okay siya guys. One. Hey guys, this is Wax. Two weeks after natin ma-unbox ang ating Oppo Reno3 guys. So right now, I can actually provide you my full review and honest opinion about the Oppo Reno3. And if this is something na pwede ko may recommend sa inyo guys. So by the way guys, as you all know, nilabas na kahapon or na officially launch na ang Oppo Reno3. And Oppo Reno3 Pro kahapon or yesterday, April 30th, 2020. And yung Oppo Reno3 will retail for 18000 pesos, while yung Oppo Reno3 Pro will retail for 28,990 pesos. Let's begin with the operating system and hardware performance para sa ating Oppo Reno3. As mentioned on my unboxing video guys, yung variant na meron tayo for this phone and the only variant na available right now sa Philippines is the 8GB of RAM and 128GB of internal storage. And kung kulang pa sa inyo ang 128GB of internal storage, don't worry guys because we have a dedicated micro SD slot for this phone and a dual nano SIM. For the operating system guys, this phone runs in color OS 7 based on or on top of Android 10 and powered na rin siya na MediaTek Helio. P90 with GPU of Power VR GM9446. And I'll be showing you guys the sample or the Antutu benchmark score na nakuha natin for this phone and also a sample video ng games and also ipapakita ko rin yung settings na meron tayo for the graphics kung pwede ba siya max graphics or ultra graphics for the Mobile Legends or not.
For the battery guys, this phone has a 4,025mAh battery capacity and capable na din siya ng fast charging up to 30 watts via Vue Flash Charge 3.0 and I must say, naglaro ako ng 42 minutes sa phone na ito so from 95% after 42 minutes of playing games it went down to 85% which is approximately 12% na na bawa sa ating battery so which I think Okay naman siya so far when it comes to the battery performance at naglalas naman siya ng buong araw sa akin na meron pang laman yung battery. So, I must say overall, when it comes to the battery performance, okay na okay siya for the Oppo Reno 3. Overall guys, I'm really satisfied when it comes to the hardware performance para sa ating Oppo Reno 3. I must say, hindi naman ako naka-experience ng any lag. And also, very okay naman siya when it comes to multitasking and social media consumption and siguro kung nagtatanong kayo guys kung umiinit ba yung phone yes umiinit siya guys but I think it's a normal thing for a smartphone na umiinit talaga especially kung naka max settings yung graphics nyo sa isang games and also depende na rin guys kung gaano nyo ba katagal ginagamit yung smartphone sa paglalaro and also don't worry guys because um, kapag uminit siya after a while naman nagsasubside rin naman talaga yung init niya so hindi siya ganun ka bothering na init like the Samsung 20 Plus na experience ko for the Exynos 990 dun talaga I must say medyo may issue talaga ako when it comes to overheating so when it comes to the battery para sa Samsung 20 Plus but for this one very tolerable naman siya and I must say Recommendable naman yung P90 niya for the Oppo Reno 3. Dewdrop not design display yung meron tayo para sa ating Oppo Reno 3 guys with a 6.4 inch AMOLED display with 1080p resolution, 411 ppi density, and 20 by 9 aspect ratio, which is a good job for this. Siguro my only request or complaint lang sana talaga for this one is sana ginawa nilang punch hole display design yung, yung Oppo Reno 3 natin like the Oppo Reno 3 China version para mas immersive at mas cinematic yung feel while watching um, movies, Netflix, and YouTube at paglalaro ng games sa ating phone. But overall guys, I'm happy and satisfied. Very vibrant as you can see ng colors. Very accurate naman siya so far. I'm actually happy and I'm really liking the display quality na para sa ating Oppo Reno 3 series. I'll just have to go back sa ating build and design para sa ating Oppo Reno 3. So this phone retails for 18,990 pesos or approximately 19,000 pesos guys. And the material yung ginamit nila for this one, especially sa likod, is a polycarbonate plastic. I just really hope that Oppo could have provided us a glass panel with Corning Gorilla Glass 5 protection. Para at least mas premium yung feels niya sa phone. And also, para masabi mo rin talaga sa sarili mo na worth it yung binayaran mong pera para sa phone na ito. But overall guys, wala naman talaga akong complain when it comes to the aesthetic and also yung look. Very premium pa rin naman yung look niya sa likod guys since this one has a glossy finish but overall again you're still paying for 19 or approximately 19,000 pesos I just really hope na sana ginawa nilang glass panel yung likod para sa Oppo Reno 3 and Oppo Reno 3 Pro on to our camera performance guys as you can see we have a dewdrop notch camera design para sa ating Oppo Reno 3 Pro with the first 44 megapixel with f2.4 aperture wide camera and for the rear or naman natin guys we have a quadruple camera setup for this phone with a 48 megapixel with f1.8 aperture wide camera 13 megapixel with f2.4 aperture telephoto lens an 8 megapixel with f2.2 aperture ultra wide and a 2 megapixel with f2.4 aperture for macro lens. And for video recording guys, in selfie camera natin can actually shoot up to 1080p resolution at 30 frames per second while yung rear naman natin can actually shoot up to 4K resolution at 30 frames per second. So I'll be showing you some sample photos na nakunan ko using the Oppo Reno 3 so you can actually decide whether or not maganda ba ang photo quality or camera performance para sa ating Oppo Reno 3.
Overall, I must say, when it comes to the camera performance para sa ating Oppo Reno 3, very detailed and sharp pa rin naman ang mga photos na nakunan natin using this phone. I also like the dynamic range para sa ating photos and the selfie camera is also good knowing that we have a first 44 megapixel para sa ating selfie camera. Very good siya in terms of low light condition for selfie. So okay na okay siya when it comes to the camera performance for the Oppo Reno 3. And also aside from the photo or camera quality para sa ating Oppo Reno 3, isa rin talaga sa mga nagustuhan ko is yung speaker quality para sa ating Oppo Reno 3 since this one has a Dolby Atmos sa ating Oppo Reno 3. So what do you think of the Oppo Reno 3? So please leave a comment down below and let me know your thoughts about this phone. At kung sulit nga ba talaga ang phone nito? Overall for me guys, sulit na sulit naman talaga ang overall performance para sa ating phone. My only complaint is yung price na nilagay nila for this phone. I think for 18,990 pesos. Meron ka na talaga mabibiling phone na mas lesser, mas affordable. Pero same yung overall performance or minsan mas higit pa nga. So yun lang talaga yung pinakomplain ko for this. I just hope that Oppo can provide us some discount maybe. Or if you're hesitant to buy this now, maybe in the future guys, you can actually purchase this one kapag nagbigay na ng discount or kapag naging generous ng Oppo to provide us a discount for the Oppo Reno 3 series. Kung nagustuhan nyo ang unboxing and full review ko for the Oppo Reno 3, please don't forget to like this video guys, share it to your Facebook account or Instagram account, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and tap the bell icon para ma-notify kayo sa mga future unboxing video ko. So once again, this is Wax from Wax Attack channel. Stay home, stay safe, have a great day guys. Bye guys!